The Lucas Oil School of Racing hosting a major event in Homestead and Miami, Florida next week. Local high school student in our area was selected to attend out of a thousand applicants. Michaela Schindler has more. A Buchanan Upshur High School senior was selected along with 19 other racers throughout the nation to compete in the fourth annual Lucas Oil Scholarship Shootout. Aiden Goldsmith has been racing for seven months now and is the only known 600 sprint car driver in the entire state of West Virginia. Goldsmith has competed in a variety of states over the past seven months in which he has won five feature races and five heat races, along with many more accomplishments. He told 12 News just how he got into racing. We went and watched the World of Outlaws race. It was pretty fun to watch and it was inspiring to me. So me and my dad went and got a car like two weeks later. Been working on it, racing it, tearing it up. Aiden and his family will drive 18 hours to Florida for the two-day event that will start on Monday, January 30th. During the shootout, participants will get to learn how to drive a different car, receive coaching from professional driving instructors, as well as participating in the shootout race. However, this is what Goldsmith is most looking forward to. A lot more experience and meet new people and see how the track is. Just a different type of racing, honestly. It's on asphalt instead of dirt that we usually race on. While this is not only an opportunity to learn how to manage a career in motorsports, there is also something else on the line. The top person that they think is going to probably be the best at it, they're going to give us $250,000 in a scholarship for racing. There will also be five other racing opportunities for the top five drivers competing at the Indy track over the course of the two-day event. If interested in staying up to date with Aiden Goldsmith and his shootout racing adventure, you can find more information at Aiden Goldsmith Racing on Facebook. I'm Michaela Schindler reporting for 12 News in Buchanan.